two heads of the company at different times, John Cena and The Rock. On a personal level, I just don't like you. The man who is responsible for the PG era versus one of the men responsible for the Attitude Era. You know, the Attitude Era was awesome. You did anything you wanted. You said anything you wanted. The Rock says, take your own head and proceed to shove it directly up your candy ass. When The Rock was at his echelon, he was able to get a mic and just kind of say what he wanted and just go off the cuff. You've got five seconds to come out here and face The Rock, or The Rock will go back there and whip your monkey ass all over the Fleet Center. All of a sudden, like any territory that goes too far, it has to be scaled back, which became the PG era. No one wanted that role. I think John Cena had the hardest role of anybody who was champion who had to carry the company. The champ is here! John Cena, he had to he had to scale everything back. It was it, everything was more under a microscope. But John worked his tail off to get that position. Hustle, loyalty, respect. That is the code in which I live by. He was doing everything and having to play within these PG rules that no one else had had to play up till him. I remember I came back like once or twice, like in, in that time frame. I remember one time. They came in the locker room, they said, uh, it's time to have rehearsal. I was just like, I wouldn't have done this very long. <laughs> <laughs> this is a true matchup of two greats who were leading the company. Once in a lifetime. <laughs>